very excited. Um, it's been a long time coming. We've been planning it for several years. It took a lot longer to build than it's ever taken us. You can understand the excitement for Chrissy Smith and her husband Ray opening their latest Dairy Queen. It never gets old, even though they've done it many times before. We just got our 30 year award. That's how, really? yes, it's actually been a little bit longer than that. It's a long story, but um, 30 years. 30 years of hot eats and cool treats. And this one, across from Children's Hospital in Bourbon, has all the newest and coolest decor. The table over here in the corner has some cute red spoons on the top. Um, kind of Dairy Queen's like little signature thing that they've started to, to really push is the red spoon. Our Dairy Queen van that we drive has red spoon running boards. I'm not sure if you've noticed that or not. I had those custom made here locally by someone in Austin Town. Uh -huh. We have the cute little swirls or curls on top of the, the tables here. And that's our little signature curl. And um, just some fun art, lots of Instagram worthy pictures in this location. Mm -hmm. We have a really nice um, mural on the wall that um, children can measure themselves and how tall they are in ice cream cones. Which is <laughs> but it's not just the decorations that make this place look new. It's a new design in the kitchen and drive through that make things easy for the staff and the food given out quicker to the customers. That's Dairy Queen's new design. They call it their new 3.0 design. So um, an L shape to the kitchen. Um, everything is supposed to be streamlined. Um, it's, it's kind of a really nice design. We do have three windows at this location. We'll have a dual lane drive through. Mm -hmm. um, we have a pay window, a pickup window, and then if we do have to pull a car because of an extra large order or some kind of a weight, we have a third window if we have to hold a car. It may seem silly, but the COVID years taught Chrissy how important the drive through really is. During COVID, of course, um, our Boardman and our Canfield store took a, a bit of a hit because we didn't have the drive through um, People were using drive throughs more than ever. Our other, other three stores that do have drive throughs were actually up during COVID, but Boardman and Canfield suffered just a little bit. Um, we were still did fine, but they suffered just a bit um, by not having the drive through So Gee. it's really important. Another rarity, Dairy Queen breakfast, only available in certain stores. There's not too many Dairy Queens in our look, our area that have um, breakfast, but they're pretty popular down south, and um, I, I love having it. We getting here early in the morning gets an early start to our day. We do serve breakfast at our Columbiana location. Our most popular items are biscuits and gravy. Of course, with our chicken strips, that gravy dipping sauces are one of our signature items. But at breakfast, we up it up a little bit. We add sausage to the the gravy. So um, sausage, biscuits, and gravy very popular. Popular food and this location, brand new, should be very popular too. Perfect for a couple important reasons. We found this property and um, it's right across from Akron Children's Hospital, which is our chosen charity. And I think it's really gonna be a great fit. I think that we're gonna get lots of hungry kids looking at us, pulling out of the parking lot there. I think it's gonna, just gonna be, even though we're not that far away, I think it's just a, a good move.